Okay, this sort of fixed itself. We'll see. So, a couple things. A couple things. Uh, <clears throat> we'll start off by saying this. Uh, I think I finished off the Red Faction 1 playthrough. Sa I don't care. Uh, saying that I remember this game being annoying to start up. And from what I remember last time, what I had to do was I actually had to... Because I got this off of not Steam. I got it off... It was a legit copy. I think it was from um, Gamersgate. It was a legit copy, but everything was fine. Like, like, like everything was fine. I had the the, uh, the the CD key and everything. Every, everything was fine. But what happened is the game just wouldn't start. It, it just wouldn't start. Uh, it would start, but then it would crash. Or for, for some reason, I think what happened is because it was programmed a certain way... I think because it was programmed a certain way, what was what would happen? What was happening uh, is that the the game was reading newer video cards, and it was recognizing, and it didn't expect the video RAM to be as high as what it was expecting it to be, right? So it was saying that you know what, as of right now, the highest video RAM I can find is eight megabytes or whatever it was. Um, and so the video card does not have 8 megabytes because I have, I think, 8 gigs on this card. So I can't play this game. I think that's where, at the time, it was like 3 gig card or whatever it was. So I think that's what was happening, is, is that it was reading the video card as not being what it was expecting and not starting. The Steam version is, but it, the Steam version actually started, which is fantastic. It's a much better start. It's a much better start. Then, you know what? Yeah, so the video game, uh, the, the, the Steam version starting is a much better start <laughs> than it was happening with the non-Steam version. Um, however, um, I did have to dick around with some of the ini files. Because for some weird reason, and I'm not going to swear because I don't want, like, I would swear. But for some weird reason, the game started on my second monitor. Like, my, my non-main monitor. Um, which is very... Which is extremely dumb. And I don't know how you would program a game to start on a monitor that's not the main monitor from, like, a game from, like, 2005 or whatever the fuck this game is from. Um, so, it is such a dumb thing. Like, how would you program a game that would start on a monitor that's not a main monitor in a time where two monitors was not heard of. Like, it, it, it's, it's just such a dumb... Th anyway, let's just start this, and then, and then we'll keep going. So, now, um, we'll start this, start this, and then start on medium to keep going with this. Uh, yeah, you know what, I'll let this go. Wait. Uh, is it, I don't think there's any subtitle options, is there? Yeah, the option menu is so bad. So bad! Option menu is just so bad. Uh, I think I I did play with this a couple days, like yesterday or a couple days ago. Uh, just to make sure everything worked properly. And everything did work properly. But for some reason, there's, there's no subtitles. So please pay attention. Sounds like Steven St like like John Statham, Jason Statham. Sounds like Jason Statham, uh, but I don't know if it is. I don't think it is. Uh, same thing happened with. That is absolutely Jason Statham, isn't it? Same thing happened with uh, Crisis. Sounded very much like a Jason Statham voice. Okay, so. I don't have a clear firing lane. You must take out those towers. Uh, look at post foundation and the adjoining wall. Okay, thank you. So, a uh, couple things to start off with this game. <clears throat> a, that sounds like Jason Statham. Just like it sounded like Jason Statham when I played Crisis. I didn't Google it, and I don't care to Google it. If I, I don't give a shit, honestly. I don't really care either way. Um, 
So it may be Jason Statham, or it may not. I don't give a shit. Like, I, I really don't care. Um, I did... Okay, so I did fuck around with this... I did play this game for, like, another, like, three minutes, just to get... Just to make sure it would work properly, and to make sure... Does that, that look fine? I don't know. That, I think, looks fine. No, wait. Does this look better here? I don't know. What about this? Let me, let me try this way. Is that... Yeah, that's fine. All right. Yes, I want to save the settings. I don't... Okay, you know what? This is going to be fine. Um, so, what did I think? Yeah, so... Right. Did I not grab enough? Okay. Yes, thank you, game! Um... Okay, I guess we did this. So yeah, so the, uh, the, um, I remember, okay, that's fine. I don't know where anybody is, which is fine. Okay, ow, oh, that's right, destructible environments. Oh, crap, that's right. So let's all, are you gonna, okay, well. I don't know where anybody else is. Uh, so, yeah. So, I remember playing this game, I don't know, like 10 years ago or whenever. It doesn't matter. Uh, so, yeah. I remember... Okay, this is... Uh, not a big fan of this uh, era of games. Just because I don't know why, I just don't like. Um, I, I'm just not a big fan of the um, the engine. The what the fuck? Okay, well, not a big fan of the engine they used, and like I realize this is probably this, like the like a a, a custom engine. Are you serious? Um, can I just blow? No, I can't blow this up. Disable the towers by destroying the power generators on their bases. I mean, this thing? And this thing? Alright. Fine. We'll just destroy all this shit. Um, yeah, so... Oh, for Christ's sake. Can I not go back here? Yes, I can. I don't... I need more uh, health. That's what I need. Is this, is this like infinite spawn? It feels like it's infinite spawning enemies. Which, as you know, I hate. And I think is very cheap. And is not a good way of discerning. Oh, is this what? Seriously? Here we go. Just do that. There we go. Uh, oh, wait. Is there another base I didn't know? See, this is another thing. Like, I don't care for this. Um, why are you... Can I... I can't destroy that. Okay, fine. Why? So, is there an easier way to well, blow shit up? Well, just don't fire then! Well, okay, well, this, this is not helpful in any way, shape, or form. Do I like, blow up the wall here? Nope! Oh, do I go this way? Okay. The fuck do I go? Disable towers. I 
I've just, like, there's three towers, and I've destroyed all three towers. What is this fucking garbage? And yeah, this infinite spawning is extremely lazy programming. Uh, do I have to hit this again? Is that what's going on? Disable the towers. Okay then. Are you fucking kidding me? Well, this game is starting off fantastic. Did I not break off all of the? Tractor base insertion is complete at Charlie Delta Zero Niner. Like, how many towers are there? There's like three towers. So let's do this. Uh, so do this. Destroy that. Destroy that. So is that not enough? By destroying their project okay, I didn't did I not destroy Okay, I'm I'm taking advantage of this because Health kit picked up, I don't care. This is not a good sign. Oh. How? What? Like, what did I not do last time that I did this time? Like, other than hit this dude in the tower when the game is telling me not... Like, I don't have to worry about the dudes in the tower. I have a visual of the target. Oh. Stand clear of the doors, Alias. This will be hot. Alright, well, whatever. Uh, I do... Okay, so having said that... I do remember the game not being as good as the first game. And we're off to... Alright, so it only took me 15 minutes this time to realize that my camera was in the way. Yeah, I, okay, so this is... This game uh, kind of remind Well, not this game. The, the engine reminds me of... Uh, Deus Ex Infinite War? No, not Infinite War. Um... Invisible War. Uh, Day 6 Invisible War. That remind. That remind. That is horrible, sir. Uh, that is absolutely horrid. Dude's like in your face as soon as you enter an area? What the hell was THQ thinking? Or Volition? Or both of them? I don't give a fuck about you. Why would I care? Oh, you know what? It's a, I'm sorry, sir. Let me just give you uh, the annuity of my... Let me give you my estate. Because it's your cousin to pay back for the wrongdoing that I've wrought upon your family. This game is not... Like, this game is worse than I remember it being. Uh, do I N N? Oh, that is not. I would prefer just being in the dark, honestly, at this point. This is like it might be fuzzy for you guys, but it's still fuzzy for me. It takes so much time to reload and to get 
ready to be able to shoot any- like, the recovery time is actually really bad on this. Okay, yeah, there's not much- <laughs> so far, I- not- I'm not liking this game as much as I thought I was based on my first playthrough. I'm also super happy I'm playing on medium difficulty, because my goal, as is my goal, uh, as was my goal with the first game, is to finish this game today. And I remember this game not being as long as the first one, which may be just bad memory. Um, but if I'm not taking as much damage as... as why are you here? Um, as I... As, as... There you go. If I'm not taking a lot of damage, then it'll make me uh, finish the game faster. I'm gonna put it that way. So yeah, this game is not off to a stellar start. I'll say that. Uh, okay. Well, that's not great. Oh, I can't go. Okay. Well, look, I'm stuck here. Alright, well, this is what about. Yeah. Let's go down here, I guess. And with night vision, that is absolutely. This is about as pleasant for me, or for you, as it is for me, just so you know. I'm not finding this pleasant at all. Um. Where is... Dude! Ow, ow. The hell is shooting rockets at me? There you go. Come on. There you go. There you go. Um, I don't... See, the weird thing is that I have three health bars. Basically. Can I just... Why is this this is like what is difference what is the difference between this wall and this wall here? Like what I want to do is blow up this wall so I can jump up and get that whatever the crap that is. But the game doesn't seem to want to want me to do that, so it's just gonna not gonna let me do that. Are you serious? You're gonna make me do this? You're gonna make me do that. Alright, fine. Um I don't know if I want to do that. Can I? Yeah, like I, like I said before last time, is that the destructible environments were really ex Press E to use devices like elevators. Oh, yeah, well, that's fine. Uh, what I was saying before I got so duly interrupted by the tutorial is that uh... I don't remember what I was saying. Hmm. The first game had destructible environments. The third game really leaned into the destruction part of things. Like, really. And you'll see that uh, next week or the week after, or whenever I end up playing that game. But for some reason, this game seems like it didn't need to destroy shit. Uh, or, it, like, even more frustratingly, it seemed like it didn't want you to destroy shit, it didn't want you to destroy. Which is just completely arbitrary at that point, and not particularly fun. So, having- oh, for Christ's sake. What is it? What the fuck? Coolant? What did you talk to me about? Coolant? And what do you want me to do? Alright, well I got things here. Uh, Clone units can be seen at the top of storage module. I don't have storage modules. You mean in the game? The fuck are the storage modules in the game? I don't understand anything of this. Contamination risk. Deactivate system prior to 
Did I not hit that before? Or is it just my imagination? I think it's my imagination. Because I clearly didn't walk up to that thing and press a button before. Clearly. Oh, was I not supposed to, was I supposed to hit that first? Really, that's, can I not, okay, well. Uh, recover the nano cell from the central core. Huh, here? Oh, okay. Well, that's not terrific. Okay, well, this is not a great introduction to the game. I'm just going to say that. We were volunteers, eager to serve as Chancellor Sopot's secret weapon. Sopot is broadcasting to studios upstairs. We kill him and get him. I think I hear them. Yes, sir. We've got him trapped. You! Inside! Come out with your hands up! Looks like we're expected. What the fuck is Moloff? Can I not go through this like a normal person? Can I just destroy? I can't destroy anything. Help get used. Can I get? Okay, for Christ's sake. Are you seriously going to tell me I have to do this? Oh my god. Uh, is that the Chancellor Spora? So, so pot? Can I E key to open some doors? Okay, that is really bad. Okay, really bad design. What? What elevator? What elevator? This game is dumb. Oh, this elevator? Oh my god. I think I'm... What? Okay. Assuming... I, I, I saw the... The stair... Yeah. Why are you so annoying, sir? Oh. Like, there's some... There's a sta There's... I know there's a thing there. <clears throat> um... An, an elevator there. There you go. No. I know there's stairs there. What is wrong with me? I think. Okay. Well, let's go this way. Wait. What? New content has been. I don't know what content. And uh, ask me if I care. I don't think I care about the new content. That's. But. Five, eh? Who's Tangier? And there's an idiot over here. No, you don't have to do anything. Can I change weapons? I can change weapons. Can 
Can I? Oh my fuck, game. I'm wondering if this is just in case you run out of grenades. Um, do I have something other than... I've... Oh, yeah, I'll take this. What? No. Oh. Where do these people even come from? That's my main question. I guess... You know what? Fuck it. Let's just go. Oh, I have to kill this thing. Seven. This one's taken a bit longer. But wait, did it just leave? It just left. All right, let's do this then. Oh. I mean, other than the. I'm gonna say, other than the really bad introduction to the game, and like, I mean, bad. This is actually not so bad. This is this is decent so far, but I'm only like ten minutes into the game, so I will reserve judgment. Oh my fuck! Are you kidding me? What do you mean the indirect? This thing? Restart. Oh, go okay. fuck. Now, is there a quick save button on this game? In this game? Something or other. Can you not? No, I can't open this until I. this why are you not dead yet sir light rounds picked up that's okay where's so wait there's, there's another idiot. Wait. Are you dead? Is this... Is this can I... Okay, well that's fine. I don't care about anything else. Is, is this... What is the... Um, controls? Uh, weapon? No, there's no quick save. Alright, fantastic. You're gonna wish you Are you fucking joking, you dipshit? Okay, so I can save progress. That's fine. I'm okay with this, I guess. What's a satchel? And then the, uh... The windows are perfectly cromulent. What the fuck? The windows are perfectly fine here. Okay. Okay, um, uh, here? 
I don't give a shit about what you're having. How did you not die? Like, this is medium. Uh, destroy. Hey, that was a, a like a super white screen. That was like a. Right? That's a 14 or 25 by 14. Is that is that really what you want me to do? No, 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 no. I I didn't what? No. I I saved Oh my god. Pretty sure I saved before, like after this transition. Yeah, 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 yeah. But how? You guys take. You know what? Let's let's try this. Let's just go this way. How are the windows not taking any damage? Well, that's kind of kind of weird. Seems to me this dude should already be dead. Like the amount of damage he's taken. Yeah, okay, that's fine. No, wait. I, you know what, I don't. Shut up. Okay, so let's, let's try something here. Save. Uh, yes, I, I'm sure I want to save that. myself over. Martians and other nonsense. That's what this game should be called. Martians and other nonsense. You know what? Fuck you. Okay, so this is the part I can't get... Okay. This is the part that's really dumb right now. Why are you even here? Where did you come from, you fucknut? Like, why would... I, I've cleared these areas. Why would you... Why would enemies show up? That's kind of annoying. Anyway. Um, okay, and here's what's kind of... Okay, save progress. Remember the room I'm in. 2002 for... Red Faction 2 was in 2002? Or the first one? Red Faction 2 seems like it should be a little bit later than 2002. I mean, if... if like, I didn't check, which is fair. But it seems like the first one should be 2001. And then, this seems like an engine that should be like a couple of years after 2002, though. Uh, you can be on the fact that it's a port from the PS2 game. Games that are at huge issues being properly brought up. Yes, no, absolutely. Um, if you've watched any of my Friday games, you all know the issues of... Oh, wait. Um, you know the issues that come about with, like, shitty ports. I don't really give a fuck about your... Uh, 
Red Faction 2001... 2002! Okay, to be fair, this actually is pretty good for a 2002 game. Um, as far as, like, graphics and engine goes. Okay, well, fucking Christ. Alright, well, that's good for this game, I guess, but... Oh, my God. I mean, it's 2002, that's that's actually pretty insane. Like, for 2002, this is actually pretty good. Like, to me, it seems like it's pretty good. Um, but, that doesn't mean it's a good game, it just means it's good for 2002. Uh, but yeah, no, games, like, a lot of games were port, like, in, in the 2010-ish like, era. Like, a few years earlier than that, a few years later than that, were... Where is my... Wasn't she in front of me just like a second ago? <laughs> what the fuck game? What the fuck? Um, games from like a few years before 2010 to a few years after 2010, yes. The ports were absolutely horrible. Uh, like I played Legendary, I played, uh, and that was a bad port. I played um, the, the Lost Planet games. The Lost Planet games uh, were not very good ports. Um, Singularity was a better port, but still not tremendous. But that was a little bit... Well, I guess it's 2006 or something like that. But yeah. Um, how's your week, though? I hope you had a good week. Your week was satisfactory. Are you going to come over here, or are you just going to be shot by this nonsense? There we go. My week is good. It was only four-day work week. Because it's actually, happy Canada Day. I mean, you're not Canadian. I know that. But you know what? Happy Canada Day, July 1st. I hope you had a good Friday. Are we, are we good to... Go to the next area? Yeah, okay. Uh, there? But yeah, my, my week was good. Again, shorter shorter work week. But... Wow. A little bit. Slow motion, or just bad engine. You decide. Oh wait, you're on my team. Still, I'm just gonna, still gonna say, <laughs> bad. Ow! Wait, what? Well, that was really dumb. <laughs> how is this game? How is this game even like allowed to do shit like that? I'm sorry, sir, but what? Maybe I should play it on easy just to be able to make sure I actually make it through the game. Uh, it's THQ published game, yes. Uh, I think it's Volition made the game. I think Volition made the first... Didn't Volition make all the games? Didn't Volition develop all the games? Yeah, the Geomod engine is fantastic. I really, actually really like... <laughs> yeah, Volition, yeah. Did one and two, okay. Yeah, Volition, I really, the Geomod engine is actually pretty fun. I really like that engine. Um, they really pushed it in three, which is kind of sad because Volition didn't do three. Uh, I don't know about further on, okay. I think it was, I think Volition did all the games. You know what, fuck. I didn't play Armageddon, I played part of, I started playing, uh, what you call it? Um, I started... Saints Row on Mars. Yeah, right. Exactly. Yes, exactly. <laughs> right. Saints Row 4 is just Red Faction Saints Row. Red Faction with Shanti. Shanti. That's exactly what it is. Oh, yeah. Now I gotta just kill shit and then just not be in that way because... Look, I don't like bullets, okay? What the fuck, game? Is this, is this a joke? Alright, sure. I mean... Uh, oh. Why not? Why would it make any sense? Like, to be, to be fair, Volition knows what they're doing. I don't understand how they... Like, this is done at... A, well, 2002 is actually really old, though. For an engine, for this type of, like for a ragdoll -y, like for an engine that has ragdoll effects, it's actually very old. Oh, fuck my life. 
Sea Storm, yeah, Sea Storm Mars. Um, I actually, yeah, the, 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 the Volition was okay. This is, okay, now, granted, I did say that I preferred Red Faction 1 to Red Faction 2. And this, the beginning of this game hasn't changed my mind that much. Um... Like, this game is a lot worse than I remember it, to be honest. But we're only started. We've only started. Maybe it'll get better. He's gonna eat me out of house and home? <laughs> He'll be right back? Yeah, you need to get dinner for me. Yeah, no, for sure, man. I mean, look, you don't have to keep... Kids are gonna forage themselves, right? They're gonna find, like, stuff on the ground and stuff. You don't need to feed them. They'll, they'll, they'll feed themselves. It's fine. Uh, reminds me of Deus Ex... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's, it's very much in the, in the line of Deus Ex Invisible War. Um... And uh, there's a couple other games from that era, like the rag. I call it. I call it the ragdoll era, because it seems like all the games at the time, like they introduced ragdoll effects, so they wanted to kind of push the ragdoll ideas. How is this game so bad? How can I? How do I? Can I just get rid of the? Oh, there we go. There we go. Got rid of that. Want something to snack? Yeah, there you go. See, <laughs> see, like I said, they'll forage for their own food. They're 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 fine by themselves, kids. <laughs> they're, they're you know they're they're they don't they don't need to they don't need to be fed. They'll feed themselves. <laughs> and like okay, so as as much as I like the geom, what is the reasoning why this this wall can't be destroyed? Like, there's no reason why this wall can't be destroyed, especially because I can be hit through the wall, evidently. Oh my god. But yeah, no, it very much reminds me of, like I said, uh, In Invisible War, Deus Ex Invisible War. Are you dead, or are you just faking? Plot armor? Is <laughs> it? Yeah, exactly, right? <laughs> This is plot armor. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't question it. It's plot. It makes sense. It makes sense. What do I this way? Like I'm. This is not even a hard mode. This is just normal mode. And it seems like the bullets, like this thing, you know, the bullets are like maybe you know, like 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 French, like Parisian poets, right? Eh, maybe I'll go where I want. Maybe I won't. I need to smoke in a cigarette. That's from the other side, maybe. Yeah, whatever, man. I don't care about you. Uh, is this better or worse than what I was at? Wall is made of the strongest material in the known universe. Well, evidently, but like, why that piece of wall, but not other pieces of wall? And like, I'm gonna save. Oh, oh, you're my my team. And I'm gonna save here, but this game's not gonna care about the save. I'm just gonna just gonna save wherever it feels like saving. All the shooters from this era, no matter the publisher or engine, all have the same aesthetic, and I love it. Um. I'm less of a... I prefer the older aesthetic. I prefer the, the, the Red Faction 1, Deus Ex 1, um, Half-Life 1 aesthetic. Um, I, I don't know why. I just prefer that aesthetic. Uh, I mean, it did what it could. I mean, all, every... Also, Jason Statham. If you... If, if my ears are working properly. Uh, yeah, I, and it's just a personal preference. Right, even like Crisis looks more like. Uh, maybe Crisis looks a bit better. No, the Crisis definitely looks better. But yeah, no, for some reason I just prefer the like old school, like old school, like 2000 ish, 2000 era games versus 2003 era games. Right, even like Hexen and Heretic I prefer over. Now, like I said, for 2002, this was like pretty sure Invisible War came out a fair bit, like a few years after this one. So this kind of 
I don't know, is it pioneered, because that's a weird way of saying it, but, um, was ahead of its time with his graphics. Maybe not his shooting mechanics, but it definitely its graphics. Um, a lot of pushing from KHQ to smooth it all out. Okay. Oh, did the Halo being so good graphically in 2001? Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When Crytek dropped Crisis using Unreal and changed... Well, Crytek uh, uses the, the Cry Engine, though, not, not Unreal. Change a graphical game uh, around the same time. Yeah. No, the thing with, with Crytek is they used their own engine, which was, like, stupid. Oh, my fuck! All these dudes that I can't hit, evidently. <laughs> why? Game, why? <laughs> yeah, they're on engine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, man, there's just so many engines, uh, which, which are dumb. It's just... Just give me something that makes me shoot shit in the face. I don't care what you call it. Like, what? Like, apart from... I mean, this engine doesn't seem to want to make me shoot shit in the face, though. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> what the fuck, game? <laughs> Look, I want to shoot you in the face, because the engine's like, nah, you're not going to do that. Um, they, they run funny. They needing, like, yeah. They needing to poop. Man, yeah. <laughs> yeah, these guys. Yeah, exactly. No, man, there's just so much... I mean, the AI, AI aside... <laughs> yeah, and like, to be honest, I think, uh, yeah, Unreal... Was it Unreal 3 came out after CryEngine 1? And Unreal 3 looked very similar, I think. Although, having said that, like, CryEngine is probably my, my favorite engine ever. Um, when you compare it to other games of the generations that it came out in, it looks fantastic. And I'm really sad that Crytek stopped making the Cry Engine. So damn good though. Yeah, I mean, you needed like a Cray supercomputer to play your game with, you know, if you wanted to play it as it came out. But, oh man, Cry Engine, like, I, I, even before I started coming, like, I just said, even before seeing your comment, I said, like, Cry Engine is my favorite engine out there. There we go. Companies had to change how they made components. That's insane. Yeah, hardware had to change to make it work. Yeah, no, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Right. I mean, look, when you're <laughs> when you're when your tagline is "Can it run Crisis?" <laughs> you know that a game has changed the landscape of gaming. And like the stupid thing with with Crisis is that ten years ten years later, like ten years later, it was still. Uh, a benchmark for video cards. That's fucking insane. Like, that's m maniacally... That's maniacal. Like, how... Oh, my fuck. Like, how... Like, that's just crazy. And I'm guaranteed that Crisis will still run worse than some of the games that come out now. Like, I will guarantee Fortnite runs better than Crisis on most computers. It's probably a joke, but it's probably not a joke on some computers. Dirty PCs into toaster ovens. Yeah, I know. I, yeah, no, that's that's actually really... No, absolutely. Um, no, it's, it's very silly how much of an effect that Crisis had on the gaming landscape. Just because of their engine they used. And I mean, Crisis wasn't... I mean, Crisis, I enjoyed Crisis a lot. Um... It wasn't, like, the best game ever at the time, but it was definitely better than Daikatana. Oh, are you a fucking game, please? Alright. Uh, also became its own... Yeah, right? Remember playing Crisis 2 on 360? And <laughs> it popped up and she like, it can run like... It can run like... Yeah, exactly, right? Want to get the remastered to play on stream? On... Yeah. Um, the... The... I think... Yeah. It should be available on... Actually, there's a big Steam sale, right? So it should be available on... You should be able to get it now, Al. How? Where did you come from? It's on Steam and Epic? I mean, um, just wait a couple months, it'll probably be free on Epic, right? Because everything ends up being free on Epic. Are you gonna... What are you gonna do? Hello? 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 
No? You haven't jumped on it yet? Yeah. No, I mean, I have... Uh, I have my my second PC... I know, my first PC. I built specifically to be able to play Crisis 2 on decent settings. Um, and it did. It did. So I'm happy about that. And then Crisis 3 came out. So I bought Crisis... Ow. Uh, 1 and 2... I, I bought Crisis 2 and 3 like as they came out. Um, so I don't necessarily need, like, feel the need to buy the remasters, because I don't think the game needs a remaster, like, especially not on PC. So you probably get mods that look better than the remaster anyway, right? Um, like, you know, knowing how companies treat re-releases, -re and how, uh, fans treat the original release, I'm gonna be very surprised if... The re-release looks better than Crisis 2 with mods. And Crisis 3 with mods. You gonna maybe, like, just fucking... Am I missing something? Well, if the game's just gonna give me free health, I'm just gonna take the free health. Alright, let him get away. I don't have to shoot him, I don't care. I can't move forward. Well, sure, the game's gonna move forward for me. But yeah, no, man, I actually really like Cry Engine. I think it was uh, definitely pushing what was possible with uh, PCs. I like what it did. And I like what it looked like. Because when you consider your home front, the revolution was running a cry engine. Alias. Engine. So um, then. Yes. We have him in our sights. Uh. Oh. Uh, I didn't mean that literally. Are we. Wait. I think Sopot's inside that building. Find him and take him down. Wipe that building clean. What building? The building I just killed a civilian in? Oh. Oh, just kill everybody, I don't care. This is fine. This is not a war crime, it's all good. Gonna keep going. I don't like on rails. I don't. I'm just trying to find a fun shooter in a stack of on rail shooters. That's what this is. Yeah, but anyway, like I was saying, I hope your week was good. And I hope your kid is having a good Friday. Also, like, is this Mars? Like, this seems to be more blue than Mars. Like, it's probably Mars. You're probably right with that, but... Um, I just don't remember... Mars having that kind of moon. At least not on the second part. Third part, part three, and part four, absolutely Mars. But, uh, sure, week starting tomorrow. Only working three. Nice! Then the vacation for four days. Nice! Oh, wait. Good to. Whoa, whoa, wait. Why am I going that way?
Can I just shoot this thing? There we go. There we go. Maybe next time you'll find your I don't wait this way? Okay. Uh I can shoot the building, right? That's helpful. Uh, I can't move up. Alright. Okay, you blow up, please. There you go. Now it's your turn to blow up. There you go. Uh, okay, give me a sec. I'll read that in a second. As soon as I stop missing my shots. There you go. Sister, parents for theme park, water park, and zoo fun this week. Yo, that sounds nice. It was like Six Flags or something different or something similar. Right? I mean, I'm. We don't have Six Flags up here. I'm trying to think of something dumb to say, but I can't. I mean, we have like Wonderland and Nahound and a couple other things, but no Six Flags. But that sounds fun, though. That sounds really fun. Um, I hope everything goes well. Alright, good. You just, like, disintegrate, completely disintegrated. Alright. Hello, Frank! Your Blizzard account is just probably better that way, man. Why would you want to play a Blizzard game? Okay, then. Great. Yeah, I know. I mean, Blizzard cares about money more than cares about people. Obviously, they just prove that to you, right? So you weren't giving them enough money, that's why, I think. Um, but what happened, though? You wanna play Overwatch 2? Why would you wanna play the Overwatch 2? Don't give them any money. Blizzard deserves, like, no money at this point. Like, legit. Like, after Diablo Immortal, and everything they've done, like, was it the WoW 3 re-release, and fucking everything else? You got no clue? You know your password and username? Have you tried to like reset your password? When was the last time you logged on as well? You had to create a new account with the same email? Yeah, that's just super sketch. When was the last time you logged in with your like your old like current Billy, old account? We have a squad in a building ahead of you. They're being hit from all sides. With PC? Yeah, I mean PC doesn't matter. Accounts yeah, an account. Wait, no, that's my dude. Why would I shoot my dude? Last months ago last year? Yeah, that's kind of weird. It should still be it should still be good. Yeah, I'm not I'm I'm honestly not sure. But like my thought on this is if Blizzard wants to piss people off, they're going to get less money. And I have no issues with Blizzard getting less money. They don't deserve any money at this point. Jalen Brack can go fuck himself with a scalpel in the ass and I don't give a fuck. <laughs> if you don't get your account back, you swear. You can just go play other things. You can play other games from companies that care about your money. Oh, I'm okay with that. Sorry, I'm I'm not being flippant about your. I don't want to be flippant about your your your, your plight. I just give zero fucks about Blizzard right now. Like actually, ever since their their Hong Kong nonsense. You spent so much time on Overwatch? Yeah. No, it, you know, it, it, it really sucks. Um, the fact that, and especially if you, if your account should still be valid, and it's not, um, I have no idea why it wouldn't be valid. It doesn't make any sense. Living up your account and shit? Yeah, no. Yeah, no, I understand. Again, especially if your account should still be good. Am I even supposed to be hitting you, or...? Okay. No, oh, fuck it. Let's just shoot you as well. Just for fun.
But yeah, I mean, you know what? You can just play more Borderlands instead. That's that's the downside. I mean, the downside. Right, or uh, you can play more. You just fucking play Roblox at this point. Seems like it's a better <laughs> use of your time. You're gonna be pissed. Yeah, no. No, I. I would agree with that. Alright, what's the. Come on, defend everything. Here. Uh, oh. Can we just... Are we good with all of this, or... Have, like, have you done your password recovery thing, or have you... I'm assuming you've tried a few different things. Dude! The ground is here! That's not how you fly shit. That's not how I fly shit. That's not how you should fly shit. Okay, we, this way then. Uh, the account isn't linked to any of your emails anymore? Well, oh, that sucks. But was, I mean, if you logged in last year, it should still be a valid account, right? Are you gonna shoot me, or are you just there for fun? Well, someone's gonna shoot me. What? Oh. Well, I can sort of shoot things, sort of. I don't want to do any of that. But okay, this way, this way. Whoa, boy! You cover your password. It's gonna get to another email if the account is still a thing. Well, can't you recover your email from your like the original account, or do you close that account? Is that why you can't get to that first one? Lol, what? Oh. Oh, these things are... Okay. Uh, what do I do now? Oh, fuck off. Was it, can I just go here? Okay, so how about... Here. Like you said, it's, a, it's an email account. If you recover your email, it's an email account that doesn't exist anymore. It isn't linked to your email. What email is it linked to? So if you do password recovery, what... How can I put this? If you do password recovery, can you get to that email account? Like, can you recover your password for your old account? Oh crap. Really? Alright, we'll do that. Alright, let's go this way then. Uh, you made a new account with the same email. Okay, so then Blizzard thinks that's two different accounts, though. Although it's weird that you could create a new account with the same email. But, what? That just seems weird to me, but I'm not going to try to understand Blizzard. Where do, how do I get out of here? This way? I guess. 
Yeah, okay. Like, am I, am I, how do I, okay. Wait, fuck it, I don't care. I know there's some other stuff over there that I could get, but I don't really care. Yeah. Yeah, so I mean, if, if you bought Overwatch on account A, and then you created account B, then obviously you're gonna have to buy Overwatch again. Oh. Is that gonna be... <sighs> you want your old Overwatch progress. Oh, I see what... Okay, yeah. So... Yeah, even then, that's going to be kind of weird. Do you have your old purchase order? I'm assuming no, but... If you have your old purchase order for Overwatch in your email, you can contact customer service and say, Hey, look, the account that bought this, I want that reactivated. Oh, that'd be kind of weird. They're probably going to ask you, why is it not activated now? But you want your old Overwatch? Yeah. Yeah, that is kind of weird. Uh, this way? Okay, so we'll get to that. Oh, can I go in here? Oh, this is... Let's keep going, I suppose. It feels weird, yeah. Yeah, my question is, why would they allow you to create two accounts with the same email? That, to me, is the weirdest thing. So do you have anything down here? No, probably not. That's useful. Is this where I'm supposed to go? I guess this is where I'm supposed to go. A, that's a very slow moving train. I've seen a lot of trains and they don't. Well, I'm fucked, I guess. Let, let's try this. Let's save the progress and then just complain when it actually doesn't save the progress. I guess we go this way? Oh, wait, no, here. Oh, I guess we can, we, can, we can hide here. Do have emails from the game? Like events and shit? Yeah. I mean, you can if, if you find the original email, like the, the, the purchase order, you can contact customer service and say, hey, look, can you reactivate this account? I now have a different account with the same email. But they might actually they might actually ask you what the original password is. You don't have your like Overwatch bot ID, yeah. Yeah, that might be I mean you can always try. Right? I mean if you don't contact customer service, you're not gonna get your thing back, that's for sure. Oh you have the password. Oh yeah, so just tell them. You have the username? Yeah, if you have the rough date, you can just say, hey, look. Contact customer service and say, hey, look, on this day, I activated this account. On this day, I use the same password for this account. Can you activate this older account? I mean, they're probably going to say no, honestly, unfortunately. But you can always try. Right, you can say you have all the information necessary for that first account, for that older one. Ow. 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 Stop it! Son of a bitch! Why do you keep exploding him?
Okay, if can I go here with any? Oh fuck this game. I mean, you gotta ask them. If you don't ask them, you're not gonna get it back. If you ask them, you might get it back. That's kind of like the only thing I can. The only. I think that's the only um, advice I can give. Let's get picked up now. You sent an email? Okay. Well, you sent an email, I'm sure. You're actually pissed? Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know, I understand. I mean. Okay, so you came from the left. Does that mean there's a way to the... Where do I go, though? Oh, do we go through the... No. Uh, you have to do something? Yeah, man. Yeah, like I said. Um, try to contact... The best thing you can do is just try to contact them. Okay, like fucking. If they have infinite spawning enemies here, that's extremely annoying. And extremely pointless. Ooh, we can get more ammo though. Okay, so we do this. Helpful this way? No, I can't even go forward here. Okay, I'll be back in just a. M yeah, man. Again, unfor unfortunately, the only thing you can do is talk to customer service. Sort of explain your situation. Hopefully, they'll understand and uh, help you out. Okay, so I'm hitting these dudes, and I'm. I feel. Cool holograms. Um, like I should be killing them, but I'm not. I'm out what do you mean you're outgunned? I got SMGs. Why are you being so dumb? Can I go here? Yes, I can. Wait, is it useful to go here? That looks like. Oh, I mean. Yeah, so if you're not familiar. Did I not kill people here already? Like... Um... Although, I don't know if you're, Are you on Mars? The company's still Ultor. Ultor is kind of like the UAC of this game, if you're familiar with Doom. What? Rendezvous with Quill. All right. Well, I don't. I can't really do much. Oh, I don't have any more ammo. Assault rifle picked up. All right. Well. 
Oh, can I go down here? This is easier? No, there's nothing here. <laughs> well, I think people got run over by a train, that's what I think. You have an estimate of when you bought Overwatch? When you created the account for your old password. Yeah. Installed into your laptop. Uh, so you need data in the files I have. Yeah, no, for sure. Like, I, I don't have any experience in that uh, as far as what um, Blizzard wants to do. But, I mean, Blizzard wants money, so... I'm assuming they're going to give you back your old account. Oh. Alright. <laughs> Where's everybody else? Oh, that's my guy. It's my guy. Yeah, like I said, the best you can do is just contact customer service, see what they say. Alias, you're the demolitions like, seems to me that it's pretty obvious what happened, but... You'll need to rig all three pylons. Knock out the concrete layer on yeah. each pylon. Then plant your charge on the steel core inside. When you're done, you'll have 30 seconds to get back here. I'll be watching your back for my scope. Okay, so the easy thing, then, at this point... Is to... Go to the furthest one and then work your way back. Alias, because train coming from my side. We gotta litter the floor with your body. Oh walls. So Oh wait. Ow. Stop shooting me! Where did you come from? Did I not just run towards you like this? Maybe I just missed the guy. Okay, well, whatever. Is that the core? Okay. Do I have to put anything in the in, in the way? Okay, we'll, we'll stick to this. So then, if we do that, unless it has to be done in a very specific Train order. Coming. Press E key. Good work. Come on. So can we go this way? Or does it have to be th in this direction? Oh, for fuck's sake, game. This is so dumb. Yeah, this is kind of dumb. Oh, 
Okay, go kill people so I can grab. Oh. So I can grab. Um, so what happens if I just do this this way? No, oh, okay. Well done. Get back here now. Within 30 seconds. Okay, I think we're safe. Well. Such a badly programmed game. Not much is getting in the way of this thing. Wait, is that it? Hey, cool. Nice. seem to die a lot later than they should. Especially for a game on normal mode. I think this is fine. Don't seem to care about it. That's fine. Hold on. Frank, status report. We're in a bit of a tight spot. Nothing we can't handle, sir. Don't want to know. Elias, enemy soldiers all around. What are you, what am I, what are you, what are you, what am I using now? Okay, so that one hundred. Oh, the hundred. Okay, that's number on the top right is your health of the health of the 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 tank. I think you have unlimited ammo here for like. Okay. Uh, what now? Oh, well, that was. Oh, wait, what? How did my tank get fixed all of a sudden? You know what? I'm not going to complain. I'm okay with this. If my tank wants to fix itself. I'm okay. Don't shoot everything, you maniacs. I have forces in the area. Remember? I don't give a shit. Somehow that's not working. What the? Okay. 
Okay, this is, I think this should be good. Blow shit up. Yeah, I'm, I'm hoping this is my what the fuck. Okay, I think we're all good now. How did you survive everything? Excuse me, sir. Oh, now you can destroy the environments. Whereas walls before are just impervious for some reason. Coming. No. Oh. Wow. Usually, if you say incoming, you're going to say what direction, right? Oh, my health is back to 100%. in front of me. Something. Oh. All right, I guess we didn't get that guy. Bonus objective, what? That's a bonus objective. Okay, I think we... Oh, I can shoot that. Wait. How's that a bonus objective? Did I miss the other thing is a bonus like the the other thing is a bonus objective? I think we're good. 
Why we're leaving when there's people shooting at I don't know, but... So now, oh. Wait, can I? Wait, where do I go now then? What? Oh, this way? Yeah, okay. Wait, can I get through... Can I look through all the rooms? Can I look through all the rooms? No, I can't. I don't know why I can't. So... What about here? I can open that. What's over here, then? Oh, a bunch of fun stuff. We have to go through that area with a... Oh my god. <sighs> okay, so then... Can I blow you up? Might as well blow you up just in case. Does that seem like a fun thing to do? Is that what people do for fun in this, in, in the distant future of like 23, 11 or what? I don't know. I don't remember what time this takes place in. Assuming the bonus objective was to not kill any of the civilians. Oh. It's Tangier. The base schematic shows subterranean tunnels all over the place. If you're not a close fight, one of them might get you to the objective faster. Oh boy. Uh, do I want to go sneaking around at this point? No, I'm just fuck that. Did I not shoot you before? Maybe I didn't kill you, I don't know. I don't. Ugh. Oh, did I not? What the, how? Okay, that's exceptionally annoying because... Okay, first of all, I don't know where I'm going to restart. It's 
Okay, not so far. Um. Now, my question is, okay, that hit that thing. Why did that not hit the thing I'm aiming at? Not a big fan of that, but I'll live with it, I guess. Blow that up. Where's the other? No. Oh. Where did my... I, okay. I was like, I'm pretty sure... Wow. Yo, there's so many people... Where did you... Okay, are you fucking kidding me? That's exceptionally annoying. That's very annoying. Like, people spawning behind you? Like, yeah, that is... Okay, I fucking hate that type of thing. Okay, that's fucking annoying. I hate that. Try this way. Yes, it'll get me to the objective faster. Because. Alright then. Uh, this area shouldn't exist. Oh, unless. Okay, it should. Okay, that's fine. Um. Uh, yeah, that area shouldn't exist. If you're not gonna make it easier, for, not easier. If you're not gonna make it possible for me. To go through? Then don't give me the option to go through. That is such bad design. That is such bad design.
out. Okay, if we wait. How am I missing all these shots, though? That's my question. Okay. Okay, well, we got this going. Now, I don't know where... So if we go here, okay, that's not helpful. Like here? Because you're just going to keep spawning this way. So what are you saying? Hold off the enemy until backup arrives. Oh, okay. Oh wait, that's my dude. Person. Helpful helper. Alright, okay, well, let's do that. What do we do now? I'm in the patrol tower opening the gate now. Say progress. I don't think it's gonna make a difference. Ammo dump will make a big bang. Okay, do it. Head straight across the courtyard through the other gates. Not me, I guess. Someone else is gonna have to do that. I'm okay with this. Oh, fireworks have started. Oh. What? Oh my god. Them dudes hiding in corners is annoying. Yeah, okay. I mean, at least they're not useless to kind of shooting along with me. I think that's good. Uh, 
Okay. Okay, so... Good. We've killed all of them peeps. No, I don't want new weapons. I want this one. Stay there or are you gonna leave? Or is there another way out of here? What if you go up here this way? Oh, we can go down. Oh my god! That's not super fair. Can you? If I die because this motherfucker's in my way. Please tell me. This dude being in the way is not exact, is not how. So none of this is actually helpful at all. My buddy's dead. Okay, so if we go over here. We, no, that's kind of annoying. Okay, so at least we know to expect a bunch of enemies down here. That's fine for now, I guess. Okay, fine. Confirming read of hot detonation signal. Coming in loud and clear. Those things are on a 45 second fuse. Better hustle. Okay, yeah. Of course you can't break that. Can you break this? 30 seconds. No, you can't.
Where, where do you want me to go? Like, legit, where do you want me to go? So let's let's check this out. That's actually a really dumb way of doing things. I guess we can go down first. Yeah, okay, so we do that. Put it this way. And then we go this way. Confirming read of hot detonation signal. Coming in loud and clear. Those things are on a 45 second fuse. Better hustle. Like, the fact that you can, you put two, and then it starts, instead of putting all three? Yeah, that's fine. We've located so far. He's moving towards a missile silo. Strike. Quill, remain outside. Hold the perimeter. Tangier, it's up to us. Alias, Repta, come to us. Hurry. Where do we go? How do we get to you? Why couldn't I get it? Okay, sure. Future Pat here uh, to explain a couple things. Uh, firstly, uh, it's Future Pat. You know it's Future Pat because I'm not super, super tired and I'm wearing different clothes. I didn't want to write down uh, what's happening um, because it would be a little bit more complicated, so I decided to say it. So what happens is the game doesn't tell you you have to press spacebar to shoot the uh, grenades or missiles or whatever the mech uh, is, is shooting. Um, I went through the footage again, and uh, there are no tooltips. tells you the incendiary grenade, 
but that's kind of a useless weapon. Doesn't really do damage against uh, the vehicles or walls or that kind of thing. So <clears throat> the game doesn't tell you about spacebar. Um, I, you know, the settings being as spectacular as they are are absolutely useless. Uh, if you look at the control settings, uh, it tells you spacebar does one thing, and it's jump, and you do that, it, it, you know, which which you can do if you're walking around and not in a mech. Um, you're in a couple vehicles before this. You're in a gunship, and spacebar zooms in uh, to make stuff easier to shoot. And you're in a tank, and spacebar does nothing in a tank. Uh, in fact, uh, while you're in the tank, right mouse button shoots the, the big shells that blow stuff up. So, um, uh, well, while, you know, in, in the mech, the mouse buttons shoot the, the, the Gatlings. So there's no indication that spacebar is a useful button here, um, right? Previously in a, a, a previous uh, vehicle, actually right before this level, I believe, um, spacebar is useless in that vehicle. So the game doesn't really convey... Uh, how to use the mech, and it's the first time you use the mech. So that's kind of uh, interesting. Um, I actually, you, know, you can see me, f you know, fucking around in the background trying to figure out what to do, and eventually I do figure it out um, by honestly just plonking all the keys on my keyboard until something happens. Uh, that's how I figured it out. <laughs> that's how I figured out what to do. Um, so, you yeah, know, I probably could have tried pressing spacebar before, but because the game doesn't tell you at all anything and control schemes are kind of wonky for games of that era sometimes uh, I didn't think of it and again I was really tired and um, I uh, had a couple drinks but I will not completely blame myself for this because again the game does tell you uh, throughout the game hey press this button to do this this button to do this this button to do this but not spacebar so um, so eventually I do figure it out and um, I'll, I'll leave you there. Uh, I will also apologize for the fireworks um, noise. <laughs> I knew they were going off in the in the outside. It was Canada Day. I knew they were going off, uh, I, but I didn't realize it would be this loud. I tried to fix it up a bit, uh, but I could only do so much. So I did what I could. Uh, my, you know, I'm, I'm not running off of. I'm, I'm running off of premier elements. So I did what I could with elements. So I'll leave you the rest of the video. Uh, it's not that long. And then I promise you that um, part two is marginally better. So keep an eye out for that. out off stream because oh I don't know how that fucking happened but okay Oh, it's space! Oh, alright. Thank you for telling me, game. Okay, how the fuck am I getting... Yeah, so the thing is that the game didn't tell you space war was a missile. And for some reason it expected you to know that. 
Where did I get my... Which is somewhat annoying. Oh, that's our guys. Alright. I guess this way? I'm not sure, but I'm assuming this way? Okay. Here? I guess over here? Oh, can I just do this? Yeah. Alright. Are you on my side? I'm assuming you're on my side because you. Why did you get the oh, E? To leave battle armor. Oh no man, I'm kinda happy. I guess I have to leave it. Uh, I couldn't leave it like four feet before that though. I tried, trust me. Uh this way? Is, am I not blasting through the wall enough? Like... Or should I be in this thing? Oh, unless I have, do I have to walk up to it? Oh, is this, unless it's this? Oh. This way, I suppose. Okay, so then we do this. I just don't need anything at this point, I guess. 
You want more ammo, maybe? But other than that, I think it's pretty good. Oh, thank you. That actually helped me. I just know... It just takes so long to reload, that's the issue. Right, now I can go back and... Bunch of stuff. Go after Sopa. I'll watch our best. Okay. So, what about any of this stuff? Health kit and ammo and crap. Waiting and haul ass. That's instructed. Come on. Oh, fucking eight. Like shooting the grenades. Is very slow. No, he doesn't remind me of. That's fine. For the honor of the Commonwealth, get your ass into the silo. I don't want to be in this room, even with that glass, with that window. Um, you may have survived. Well, sort of. Well, that was a short game. All right, thanks, chat. 
Red Faction HQ. Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't understand what's going on with the cutscenes. It's just so bad. Alias, my heroic demolitions expert. You are just in time for my announcement to the squad. Soapbot's armies have declared their loyalty to me. I am now Chancellor of the Republic of the Commonwealth. I don't understand. I, I thought we supported the Red Faction. Yes, I know. I think we all agree that Echo here is an ass. Where we differ is that you and Tangier support the Red Faction. They would destroy the technology that created us. I will use the nanotechnologies it should be used. I will create an army that cannot be defeated. We trusted them. Hailed them as heroes. But they got the drop on us. Open fire. Ah, uh, yeah. I witnessed it all. Hero hid behind his desk. Seems he didn't have a weapon. It was symbolic. Our new government would have ushered in an era of peace. Peace? Then what use would we be? We were created to fight. When Tangier arrives, you three will be declared enemies of the state and publicly executed. I don't think so. Shoot him. You, put down your weapons. Shoot him. I'd kill them all, but Molon's army would be on top of us. Shoot him. Passageway behind the banner. Get out of here. Molon has unleashed the process on the military, on the Red Faction. Our faction fighters are yeah. pinned down nearby. Help them. We're counting on you. Echo out. Okay, this is where I'm logging off. I'm so tired.